We are under the lights here on a Friday night at Oracle Park in San Francisco. Tonight, game two of this four-game weekend set between the New York Mets and the San Francisco Giants. Live baseball here on MLB Network, and it comes your way next. Coming to the plate now, Matty number Burr. 87. It the was a two-hit effort for him, including a home run in last night's game. Ready to deliver. Here's the first pitch. Big swing, but he just gets a piece of it. Strike one. Guys, you take a look at the Giants as they begin play here tonight. They come in looking to turn things around as they've dropped two straight. Yeah, Matty V. And you know what, D-Ro? Now I guess it's time where you push that go button. You're getting a little sense of urgency. They find themselves in third place. And if they want to be part of the postseason picture, it's time to get going and get going pronto. Yeah, it's taken too long for this team to carve out any identity for themselves. They're going to have to find a way to get on a roll. Offensively or pitch better, something's got to change. Well hit deep down the right field line into the cove but foul. Shoots this one over come on, the front. Come on, come on. Oh, and he can't pick it up cleanly. And a great job to stick with it as he's able to make the play for the third out. Down in order, go. Now in the box, number 87. 0 for 1 for him here in this one. First delivery to him on the way. High and deep to right center. Nieve going back, still going back. Into the bleachers and gone. So it's a two run shot to right center 46 now for him on the season as the Mets are out in front now two to nothing. Certainly a tape measure shot there as we take a look at it with our show track technology. 111 miles an hour was the exit velocity so it comes as no surprise that it carried as far as it did. Number 87 will stand in again as we flash you back now here back. to the fourth inning. Number this was a two run home run that was definitely one of the big blows of the ball game to this point. Ready with the first pitch. Here it comes. Shot to first base and caught there to end the inning. Stepping in, Bobby the Fink. Right he looked Number to bounce nine. back after striking Bobby. out his last time Fink. up. Yeah, Matty, big time K last time up. One, one, tough one. series for him so far. You can tell he seeing the ball off this team. Let's see yeah. if he can make an adjustment right here. And that's the second out. So another exceptional effort for him on the mound. He's got the shutout working here as we'll show you the league ERA leaders. And as you can see there he's holding down the top spot in the circuit here for the month of June. Into the box now number 87 bat. batting from the number right side with the southpaw on the mound. First pitch of the at bat on its way. Fouled off. Calderon over at second. Feliz on at first with two down. Lofted in the You're air scoring. out toward right center. Calling for it. Fink. And that's the third out. So it's no run. Standing in, Jose Nieve. The center fielder, number 28. Jose Nieve. 
One, one, Brown one. to the left side. On to first, so a good bounce back pitch there as he gets the ground ball for the first out. Four wins in a row for these guys, and I'm sure they're feeling pretty good about themselves. We'll see how long they can keep this up. Close one tonight, 2-1 to one the final score. The Metropolitans, with their 50th team win, tops in the division. Vladimir Delgadio wins his league-leading 10th game of the year as he turns in eight strong innings of work. Ricky Moyer takes the loss despite allowing only one earned and one unearned run. Justin Heck wraps it up for the save, his 21st of the year. So that's a wrap for us in this one. Mark DeRosa, Dan Plezak, Heidi Watney, Matt Vaskersian, we all thank you for watching Major League Baseball on MLB Network. See you next time.